Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing a huge NACD or NAKD, I'm not sure which way you pronounce it, try on with you guys, obviously in their sustainable collection and oh my god, I was so impressed with the amount of stuff they had and also the types of pieces they had. I could have gone to town, but I did get quite happy clicking, I'm not going to lie to you guys, which is why I'm going to get straight into this week's video because there is quite a bit to get through. So guys, remember to subscribe to my channel and let's get into this week's video. So I'm gonna start off strong with the first piece, or should I say two piece? It's a midi skirt and a crop. So it's in this gorgeous khaki color and the fabric is this sort of ribbed jersey, which is very soft, very stretchy and very comfortable. And it also gives that lovely casual look. I know I've got them on with heels, but I would totally wear this with trainers much more than the heels, but I thought it looked cute with the heels. Um, so the crop is like a longer crop. It's not like right under your bust, which is nice. And what I love about this entire piece is the back. Can you see it's sort of a delicate back rather than the sort of blocky back that you get, which I just think really adds to the two piece. I got this in a small, which I thought would have been fine because of my bust, but actually I could size down. So I am gonna be grabbing an extra small in that. And with the midi skirt, I got in a extra small. And although that is quite undersized for me, I probably normally go for a small, I probably size down again to an XXS, which they do. So I will be grabbing that. I know that this is meant to have this sort of loose bodycon look, but I just wanna feel a bit more snug on the bottom. But other than that, I absolutely love this, guys. What do you think? For me, this is a keeper, but as always, I love to hear what you guys think. Next up is this gorgeous nude crop top. It's long sleeved, it has a high neck, and it's got this sort of wrap or pleat feature at the front. Obviously, you'll see better with me wearing it, but it just gives me like Grecian vibes. I just love this kind of look. It's something that I haven't seen before. It's only recently that I've seen this style, which I really love. And I just think paired with jeans like I have it, or even black jeans or high-waisted trousers just is such a lovely look, especially for the evening in spring and summer when you're going out. I got it in a size small and I think that would be true to size. Any tighter, then you would lose the, the detailing of the draping at the front. The material's in this Lensing Eco Vero and it is so lovely, it's soft, it's stretchy and it's very, very comfortable. So let me know what you guys think. I love this top, I just think it's such a lovely vibe. If I could get a skirt in the same color and style, then I just think that would be such a lovely look. But let me know and we're gonna move on to the next one. Moving on to this oversized jumper. It is huge and exactly what I wanted. I am in love with this jumper, guys. It is, as you can see, extremely oversized. It covers your bottom, it covers the front. I know a lot of women, especially in leggings, don't like to show that area, so it covers that. It is so comfortable. It's got this fleece um, lining, which is so cozy. It literally feels like you're having a big hug. And this just teamed with cycling shorts or even just leggings, trainers. It's such an effortless look, especially with the way the weather is in the UK at the moment. You need these kind of things to throw on because it's sunny, then it's raining, then it's hailstones, then there's wind. So if I'm wearing cycling shorts with the top or trousers, then I can just throw this on and it looks really cute and I am nice and warm. I got it in a size small, so I would probably size down to an extra small because it is very oversized. I know it's supposed to be like that, but I just want to see if the extra small just gives that little bit of difference. So I will be getting that, but I am definitely keeping this. I got it in color beige, although it's not very beige, it's more stone, which I love. It also comes in navy, black, lilac. There's so many colors. So Fanya's already bought the navy one. My mom's already bought this one. So we'll be twinning, but it's just one of those jumpers. Like everyone that's seen me in it are just like, oh my God, I love it. Where did you get it from? So yeah, this is definitely a keeper, guys. Let me know what you think and we can move on to the next one. Next, we have another two piece, but this time it is a two piece suit. Guys, oh my God, I have literally fallen head over heels with this suit. It fits so well. The color, like everything. Oh my God. Okay, so. I've never had a matching suit like this, and when I saw it, I thought, you know what, I'll give it a go. It's in a sage green, so it's not as sage green as I thought it would be, but actually, the color is really lovely, because it's not so obvious, so you're gonna get a lot of wear out of it. So I've got it on for you, and I've paired it with just a YouTube, but you can put it with like a camisole, you can button it up. I've got it on with trainers, but you could totally wear this with heels and dress it up. So we'll start with the trousers. They are so comfortable, guys, and they fit fit so well around the waist. They really cinch you in 
and then the rest of the fit of the trouser is slightly looser so it doesn't feel too tight which is just perfect the length is great as well you can see i've got it with trainers and it works as again with heels it would be the same you've got a double fastening at the top so you've got the button and then the hook and then they will look like that i got these in a size 34 which i think is their smallest size and they fit me well especially around the waist because i struggle with my waist to bottom ratio so these fit perfectly and they don't squish my bum in i would say you could stay true to your size but if you really want to cinch in that waist then maybe size down because the rest of the trouser there's enough space then moving on to the blazer oh my god i don't think i've bought a blazer yet where i don't think i need to tailor it in this fits so well the tailoring is so lovely um, i'm just so impressed you've got a bit of padding in the shoulders which gives it a lovely structure you've also got these lovely lapels the blazer is very plain and just tailored very well and i just think when you get a really well tailored blazer it does all the talking the other thing with this blazer you don't feel restricted in it sometimes i can feel quite restricted when i move but i don't know if the fabric maybe has a tiny bit of give the fabric is recycled and oh my god you just couldn't tell you really couldn't tell i got it in a size 34 again i would say that's my true size i am in love with this suit it comes in two other colors i think lilac and like a like a salmony pink i'm not sure i'll link it all below for you guys but yeah i just loved this sort of sage color i think i'm gonna get so much wear out of it and i really needed something like this for my wardrobe so guys let me know what you think but yeah I'm ready to pull the tags off this one. I'm going to move on to a dress next. And this I picked up, I think it was in the sale and I thought this would be such a lovely piece for summer. I can imagine going out in the evening or even the day. Like this is one of those dresses you could wear day or evening. It's this off the shoulder sort of lace front wrap dress. I'll pop it on for you guys so you can see. It is so comfortable again and the first thing that stood out for me with this is you know when you get these off the shoulder anything it can be quite restrictive and then like your fat will show on your arm or my fat shows on my arm but this is really stretchy so you can move your arm you don't feel restricted you don't get that sort of like double line so i originally got this in a 34 and then i had to size up to a 36 because it was too restrictive over my bust there isn't very much stretch in the fabric you do have this zip on the side to help you get into the dress which i got into it just felt too restricted but what i think is a shame for me is that i've sized up and it's still quite loose around my waist so for that reason i'm not going to be keeping it but i'm so upset because i just absolutely loved everything about this dress it's got a lovely wrap skirt with the frill lace detailing you can see and that runs the whole way around the bottom of the skirt all made from recycled fabrics again i'm honestly just so blown away by the quality guys i can't tell you this with the tan is going to look so beautiful but unfortunately not for me i could cinch it in with a belt but i just think you know there's enough going on with the dress it should just stay quite simple um so yeah i'm going to send it back unfortunately but let me know what you guys think and we'll move on to the next one Moving on to a knitwear piece. So again, like I mentioned, the weather's crazy. So I wanted to get quite a nice piece to wear with jeans and heels um, if I'm going out for dinner or anything like that. So I got this black wrap oversized cardigan. It has huge balloon sleeves. It comes in at the wrist. I got it in a size small, which I wouldn't change. I wouldn't want to go any smaller because it is cropped and I wouldn't want it to get more cropped. This is something you would have to wear with, I think, high-waisted um, bottom so I've got it on with jeans um, and some heels and this is just how I would wear it it's a heavy knit and it is quite a heavy piece but it is going to keep you warm but you still look like you've made an effort and put together just in case it wants to continue to be cold and rainy in the UK so yeah I love this piece guys let me know what you think um, and I'm going to move on to the next one moving back into the spring vibes with another dress and it's actually the one I'm wearing at the moment it is this sleeveless midi shirt dress it says that it's a gray but i would say it's more stone it's got buttons running all the way down and then you have a tie up in the middle you can obviously see it better on me here and i just fell in love with this one i saw i've been looking for a dress like this this one is so comfortable it's so so lightweight you can literally just throw it on and you look so put together i've got it on with heels but i would totally wear this with trainers most of the time because i live in trainers but if you prefer a heel then definitely like a small kitten heel works so well with this dress 
I got it in a size extra small and it actually fits me fine. It is a little bit snug on my bust here because I'm bigger busted, but overall, I think if I went any bigger, it might look too big. So maybe size down with this one if you have a smaller bust because it is still quite giving. The belt is the same fabric as the shirt. It's plain, it ties up nicely. You can obviously swap that out for your own belt and that would look just as nice. But yeah, I just love this. You can tell I'm keeping it because I've got it on and the tag is off. My style is quite neutral, so I wanted to get a bit of color into this try-on. So I ordered just a standard halter neck ribbed bodycon dress. You can't really go wrong with it, but for some reason, I'm just not feeling the color on me. I don't know, you guys tell me, but I'm just not getting that yes moment when I put it on. And that's the moment I need to have for anything to be kept because I don't like anything in my wardrobe that I just don't use. So I got this in a size small and I would say it's true to size. I wouldn't really need to go bigger or smaller. Obviously it's all recycled and it's their sleeveless ribbed midi dress. There's not much to it guys. You can dress this up, I guess, and you can go out in it. I think the only thing that would let that down if you were wearing this in the evening is that it's ribbed and ribbed for me is quite casual and day but if it's not for you then you could totally wear this out but you could get loads of use out of this paired with some trainers maybe I just need a tan maybe that's what it is I don't know what do you guys think should I keep it do you like it let me know guys and I'll move on to the next one we have another dress and it is a long sleeve wrap dress. I've been looking for one of these for so, so long and I loved this color, dusty dark pink, which I think looks really nice on me, but I don't know why, but I don't feel that this piece is doing it. Like it's close, but it's not, it's not quite there yet. I don't think it's fitting me well across the shoulders. I think the skirt bit just needs to be a little bit bigger but overall it is a lovely dress it's very soft it's very comfortable I got it in a size small I did think about sizing up just to get a bit more material in the bottom but then I just think it's going to look way too big everywhere else so yeah it would be true to size it does come in black too so maybe it would look better in black it does have that ribbed jersey material again which I think suits this kind of dress I've got it on with heels and it looks cute and dressed up and you could also wear this with trainers day to day. It's a lovely, lovely dress. I just wish it fit me better. But what do you guys think? Let me know and let's move on to the next one. I told you there was a lot to get through, didn't I? But we're nearly at the end. There's only a few more pieces, guys, and they are lovely. They're really lovely pieces. So next up, we have another shirt dress and it's an oversized one. So there are a few detailings to this dress. The first thing is these beautiful sleeves i just think they are so lovely you have this collar i can't remember the name of this collar but it just works with the dress it makes it look a lot more casual and then you have this sort of tiered skirt and it is oversized i popped it on with trainers and heels so you guys can see and i've also left it without a belt and also you put a belt on i didn't have a thicker belt i think a thicker belt would work better with this dress i got it in a size 36 and actually thinking about it I should size down. For some reason, I thought I got a 34. So I'm gonna try and size down. I just think it's a tiny, tiny bit too big for me, but I could be wrong. What do you guys think? I think you could even throw a jumper over this. This could be a piece that you wear through to autumn and winter. I think this is an all year round piece and I absolutely love it. Just like everything else in today's try on, it is so comfortable and it's actually 100% cotton. So it's lovely and soft, which is great. So I was in two minds with this one just because of how big it is. But now that I've seen there's room to size down, I'm going to, and then I will make my decision. This is a piece that you could get so much use out of. And that is really what I look for when I buy clothing. I like to try and use it most of the time and it doesn't just sit in my wardrobe so yeah i'll have to keep you up to date on that one i'll let you know from my instagram you'll probably see me styling this one up on a reel because i have so many outfit ideas for this piece next we have a little cardi and i really wanted to get something in this pastel blue because it is just the color of the season this is a very lightweight cardigan which is something i really need to add to my wardrobe because i either have too heavy or strapless naked basically so this is something i wanted to add and i've been looking at cardigans like this because i think they look so cute just with like mum jeans this cardigan has the pearl buttoning on the front which i just fell in love with and it does come in several colors but i loved this color i got it in a size extra small i could probably size down i personally think it's a tiny bit too baggy in places but i don't know whether that's just the cut of it or that it's too big for me so i could try and size down I'm not sure though whether I want to keep it. What do you guys think? I love the color on me, but I just don't know if it's fitting me the way I want it to fit. But it's very comfortable, it's very soft, it's very stretchy, 
As with everything else, I think there isn't one thing in this whole try-on that is uncomfortable. Not mm. one. It's We're nearly at the end, guys. This is the final piece and it is well worth the wait. It is this gorgeous, gorgeous black bodycon dress with these beautiful, huge balloon sleeves. And this detailing just gives this dress that something special. The sleeves are quite structured and they sit up so you have that detailing there and then they balloon out and come back in. You have a button fastening at the neckline and the material is textured, which I think is lovely. Sometimes when it's plain black, it can look a little bit shiny and very corporate. There is a zip on the side of the dress so you can get in. This is a very fitted dress. There is no stretch to it whatsoever, which isn't a problem because you're not taking wide steps in this and it isn't restrictive anywhere. So the fact that there's no stretch isn't a big deal. I got it in a size 34 and I'm happy I wouldn't go any bigger. It's supposed to be bodycon and fitted, but I am just in love with this dress. I cannot wait for the next event to pop this on. I do think that you could wear this to work as well as going out. I think it's quite versatile like that. You could pop a belt on it. I just love structured pieces like this and it's definitely one I really want to keep. The only thing that makes me hesitant is there's not enough places to go out to at the moment, but hopefully that will change. What do you guys think? Should I keep it? Let me know. And that's it. We've come to the end of this week's video. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope you liked what I picked. I'm going to have to have a serious think about what I'm keeping because there is a lot there and I'm not keeping it all. But guys, please comment below and help me out. Thank you so much for watching this week's video, guys. Please remember before you go to subscribe to my channel. And I'm also over on Instagram. It's at Honesty Alessandra, where I will be styling a lot of these pieces up so you guys can see what I'm up to over there. Guys, stay safe and stay healthy and I will see you in next week's video. Bye, guys. Oh, 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 oh,